Hello, my name is Orishaba Colin Clever. I'm a professional visual artist. I hold a diploma and a bachelor's degree in art and industrial design from Baganda Royal Institute and Tambogo University. I love art and I loved it from way back when I was still young. I was inspired by my late mother who used to do weaving of all types, that's basketry, uh, mat, and, and fabric decoration. I started practicing art when I was at age of nine. I used to just uh, arrange my mother's materials, but I could get inspired from how she used it to weave. Uh, then I started uh, redefining myself as an artist from Form 6. I went for diploma and degree. I did all my masterpieces in art and industrial design. Uh, to get back a little, I majored in weaving and printmaking. I have joined several exhibitions in in East Africa, in Uganda, I've joined so many exhibitions and workshops. But now I'm so glad to be part of this exhibition, second edition, East Africa Connect for Visual Arts. Uh, I was able to do this art piece titled Sailing Home. I'm born from Kabale, Lake Bunyoni. I'm used to waters, but there we face challenges. That's why you're seeing a dugout canoe uh, with uh, a person in it controlling it, another one in the middle, while we're pulling uh, a cow in water, and another fancy boat having uh, people in their leisure time enjoying life at the lake all demonstrating or showing people how rich people travel at the lake. Why did I do this? Uh, I did it because uh, for us at the lake, if you don't have money, you, you use a dugout canoe and it will take you long hours to sail to your home. It is cheaper, like start from 500 shillings to maybe 5,000 depending on the journey you're traveling or the journey you're going to cover. But a journey of like one kilometer, you, you take like three to five hours canoeing at the lake, going home, just covering a journey of uh, one kilometer. But when you have uh, a motorboat, uh, you, you use like maybe 10, to, to 20 minutes, depends on the engine. So uh, I was inspired by this and I made it under printmaking because li life at the lake is not so easy if you don't have money. If you don't have money, you just enter into a dugout canoe and you don't have a, a money to hire a life jacket, you just go without anything. When the lake becomes wavy, just expect to, to drown or to rest somewhere at the island. You wait until when the lake is calm, that's when you continue. But when you have money, just you hire a, a, a life jacket or buy your own, enter a fancy boat, a roofed. When, when it is raining, you can't, you can't get wet. You continue and reach your home at the, uh, at the time you, you want or at your expected time. No challenges. Yeah, uh, I'm so glad that I'm one of the exhibitors and uh, I, I hope to achieve the best in other years to come or in other editions to come. Thank you very much. That's all.